Welcome to Fort Collins, Colorado, home to the Colorado State Rams, settled at just over 5,000 feet, and we have a game that will live up to the altitude. This matchup today, part of the lifeblood of the sport, a rivalry game where the results will be remembered for a lifetime. The Rams will get us started with the opening kickoff. And he takes this from inside the five. Nice job executing all of the assignments as they put a stop to that return at the 22. The Cowboys' offense is on the field for the first time today. These rivalry games can really get the blood pumping, and we'll see who can manage their emotions best early. Everyone's been waiting for this game, right? You know both of these teams have had this game circled all the way back to the beginning of the offseason, so you've got to be able to play under control. With passion, with energy, with hatred, because it's a rivalry game, but keep your emotions in check and making sure I'm controlling what I can control. Finally run out of bounds, but he has this offense rolling with a first down. Fresh set of downs after the completion. Still on his feet at the 45. He stopped at the 45 after picking up 10 yards and the first down. And the Cowboys come to the line with a new set of downs. Fires to the wideout. Oh, he drops the football. He had him right down the gut of the field. Instead, it'll be second down. Couldn't make the connection last time. Let's see if they throw it again. That's caught. It's Brown. It's loose. Defense just cradling that fumble and securing it. These wide receivers are so fast nowadays. They're such big playmakers. I just want to get it to them and let them make it happen. But a lot of times, we're running to them, too. We're focused on chasing them down. We'll hang on here. The coach has called a timeout. He wants the officials to take another look. Thinks he's got a good shot at getting this one overturned. So Colorado State's offense will take the field for the first time. As dynamic as this guy is on the outside, Jesse, you know he's going to be cheating that way from his free safety position. You're right, because as a quarterback, I just can't throw to my guy in the perimeter, right? I got to attack the middle of the field. The problem is you've got one of the best safeties in the nation who likes to lay people out. Yeah, roaming the middle of the field, reading the quarterback's eyes, and he's got an eye on that receiver out there, too, that's dynamic. So let's see what kind of day... And the Rams headed quickly to the line. Listen, I know there are a lot of DBs out there that all they want to do is get interceptions and dance in the end zone. This dude... Wants to throw on first down. A strike downfield. He's run out of bounds, but a big play on that one, and it'll be a first down. Big chunk play to start this drive. Now they'll really try to take it to this defense. And a really short game before he gets a whole bunch of company from the defense. Picked up two yards on that last one. They need eight on second down. Pocket starts to collapse. Nowhere close on that one is he got thrilled trying to deliver the football and now they face third down. Last time these two got together, it was a tight one, Jesse. Seems like every... And that's a live ball. Oh, looks as if the defense got it. That looks like a really... Dropping back, it's Svoboda. Got room at the 35. And they'll move the chains and get it to the 47-yard line. That's the way to start a drive, and now they'll try to follow up on first and 10. What a weapon this guy is, right? The tight end position, not only can he get open, he'll take a shot. He was open, he had it, and he dropped it. Would have been a touchdown. Instead, it's second down. And the incompletion brings up a second down. He let that thing fly quickly, but he couldn't make the connection. Things started out great on this drive, but then a couple of incompletions, and now it's third and ten. Throws to the tight end. 
It's caught. Lots of green grass as he gets it to the 31. The Cowboys are moving quickly down the field. Third down, the focus of the defense has to shift. It has to change. We have to understand now exactly where the sticks are. We can't give up those plays for them to get beyond the sticks and get those first downs. And he was drilled just as he released the pass. It's incomplete. Balls have the 25. They're in field goal range, but they love to convert this third and short. Quick strike complete. Dragged down to the turf, but not before getting the first down. He might have expected to see this DB up in his receiver's kitchen instead. Nice little zone, and they pick up the first. Man, offenses are getting so good, Reese, at seeing the holes in the zone, knowing you're in zone, knowing where to sit down, how to make it an easy pitch and catch for the quarterback, and that's what it was on third machine. Into the end zone, and he's got it! Touchdown, Wyoming! Well, the defense is going to have to find an answer for this tight end down in the end zone. You cannot... They'll throw it on first down. Fires to the big fella. How about this backer in pass coverage and bringing the big hit stick with him, too? Really good concept there to get things going and use the tight end early. Yeah, I mean, just such a great job on first down, setting up an easier second down. Understanding I don't always have to push the ball down the field, but see the tight end, make the throw. No, it's not a big game. It makes life really easy on me on second down. Nice pitch and catch there, and they'll have enough for the first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. To the air on first down. Getting some heat. And he was hit just as he released it, and it falls to the turf. Really nice pressure by the defense, getting in there quickly, getting a hit on the quarterback, making the quarterback make a quick decision, and he makes the wrong decision. He throws into double coverage, but that's really because of the pressure in his face and the physical hit on his body. I love the anticipation on that throw by the QB on the out route. You gotta throw it before the receiver comes out of his break. Nice work. Brought to the ground, but not before getting it up for the first down. Well, this offense is sending a little bit of a message here. Of course, we know how much they've struggled on third down all season long. They're just never able to seem to get into a rhythm. But after that last running play, moving the sticks, you just wonder what that does for their confidence. They'll line up for a second down play. Back to pass. It's Svoboda. He looks that one in nicely. He will step out of bounds, but not before the big pickup and a first down for this offense. And the Cowboys come to the line with a fresh set of downs. Quickly to the tight end. Net had all the makings of bug meat windshield, but how about the little corner taking on the big tight end and keeping him from getting the first? The aerial assault continues. A shot toward the end zone. Pass is incomplete, but there is a flag, and the D might have been a little too rough on the quarterback there. Defense. Look, you want to make the quarterback feel you. You want to get pressure in his face. That was so close, but just a tad late. Motion from the offense. Comes out throwing on first down. Working the middle of the field, and it's complete. They get it down to the seven on that pass play in prime position for a score. Well, we knew coming into this game, this offense was going to try and get this receiver involved and get him involved early. So here they are just finding an easy completion. It's not a touchdown, but they just want to get this guy lathered up and get him into a run. He's looking for an open man on second down. Takes the easy throw in the flat. Crisp execution in the passing game, and they've got it down to the three. You know, sometimes even a short game like that can be used to set up something bigger later on. No doubt, Reese.
least they can pump that and take a shot down on the field. And don't worry, they're going to go back to that same play because they know this guy with the ball in his hand. To the end zone, and it's picked off. And he's brought down, and his defense gets the ball back for its own. Just such a nice job. Looking downfield, it's Svoboda. It's complete to the right. He's run out of bounds, but not before. Turning in a big pickup and moving the sticks for a first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. He wants to throw. Unloads to the wideout. Wide open downfield. Off he goes. And after gobbling up some serious yardage and showing off those wheels, he's finally out of bounds. That big play put them in business. Now they're right on the edge of the red zone as they go to work first and ten. Got his man downfield. They're able to keep him out of the end zone. He'll be stopped at the two after the big play in the passing game. The Cowboys trying to pay off the threat on first and goal. Can't make the grab as he was going for six right there. Two of their three red zone trips have come up empty. They'd like to punch it in here on second and goal. He's looking to throw. He snares it in the end zone. Touchdown, Cowboy! They'll crank up this drive with the pass. Finds his back in the middle. Put it right on him. Sweet play, good pick up, and they'll move the chains with the first down. New set of downs after that completion. He's looking to throw it. Got his man. Yeah, and you see running backs in today's football, they play wide receiver basically for you, but you got to find a guy that you can throw it to, and you know he's going to catch the ball consistently. He's going to throw deep right side. And the incomplete pass taking a shot on second down, and they'll be left with a third down. That last incomplete pass has him staring at a third and three. Got his man quickly. That'll be enough for the first down, and they'll mark it at the 48. And the Cowboys are on the move. Wide out in motion. Quarterback quick pass to the receiver. He's brought down, but he went backwards after that completion, not the way they had it drawn up. Couldn't get him blocked on that last one. Now it's second and 14. Trying play action. Rifles it down the middle. And the pass is intercepted. And they'll close in on him after a good return on the interception. Most defenses are lucky if you have one good covering corner. Fewer are lucky if you have two. They've got three DBs, three corners that can play at the same time in their nickel package that they feel can go mano a mano with anyone in the country. And you saw it on that last play coming later. Third and To the air, it's Svoboda trying to get to it. He's in a world of trouble, and down he goes. A catastrophic loss on that play. They'll dial one up on second and six from the 25. He's looking to throw. Nice defensive play to get a hand in there and knock it away. 
defense is heating up. They got an interception. The last possession, you can tell, breaking on the football really, really well, seeing where the quarterback's throwing it, going to try to get it. Got another hand on it, almost had another interception. The Cowboys will line up to punt it away. Well, they weren't able to gain a lot of real estate on that last completion deep down in their own end. If anything, if you're looking for a silver lining, I guess the punter maybe has a little bit more room to try. They're going to open this drive with a pass. It's complete to the left. And he's brought down, but a flag is also down. Hold it. Hold it. Up and up and They say you could call holding on every play. Well, they did on that one. On first down, here comes this offense. Wide receiver now comes in motion. The snap sets up to throw. Feeling some heat. And the pressure gets him back at the eight-yard line. The defense coming up big there. And the sack is great, but the secondary deserves some credit, too. No doubt. When you can cover like that in the secondary and drop back in your zone and only rush a few, and you feel... He just kept going backwards. They're going to throw it to start the drive. He hurls one deep down the left side. He's got it downfield for a huge game. Well, offensively, they knew they were going to have some matchups they could take advantage of in this one. And all of a sudden, this quarterback has now over 300 yards passing in the game. Defensively, David, he has got them on their heels. And he's been showing you a little bit of everything. He can throw it all over the field to all different receivers, to his tight ends, to his running backs. Really has the ability to spread it around. And now over 300 yards. Still some time left, and he can put up even bigger numbers. And, heck, go chase some awards. Get some postseason awards. Get an All-American. Just put up a day. Quarterback had everything he wanted there. He knew pre snap exactly where he was going. Of course he was going to be going towards his primary target. He just can't hook up with the completion. Coming after it. And the defense picks up a sack, getting the quarterback down at the 44. And the Cowboys send out the punt unit. And I love playing man coverage on the back end. Getting in those receivers' faces. Don't let them feel comfortable. And, and okay, ready? They'll come out on this drive and let it rip. And he is finding wide open defenders all over the field. His third interception of the day. Trying to start the drive with a pass. Looking to the big tight end. And he's lucky to get that one back. This junior quarterback knows better than to try that too often. Last incompletion leaves him still sitting at their own 25 with second and 10. Not in lockstep there with the receiver. Well, they've thrown two straight incompletions, and they just need to play pitch and catch on this next play. They're down a possession, and you don't have to necessarily get the first down right here. But if you don't get it, you've got to at least keep the fourth down manageable to give yourself an opportunity to keep pushing the ball down the field, give yourself a shot to win. It's a one-score game lead, and they've got to go for it on fourth down. He'll try to throw and pick up the first down. Can't Looking to throw at Svoboda. And he got smacked just as he released the pass. It's incomplete. And the quarterback gets hit again. We already know this defense has gotten home to him multiple times in this game. So here you are. You're trailing in the game. Defense knows you're going to throw it. They're pinning their ears back. You can't feel very confident right now if you're the play caller. And certainly if you're the quarterback, you're going to have time to throw. For the offense. Off the play fake on first down, wants to throw. Just masterful working that sideline and getting the toe down for the catch. And they take another look at the play, but the officials on the field were right, and the play will stand. On the 
Maybe this will breathe a little life into this offense, which has been flatlined in the second half. Here's first and ten. Throws for the tight end. Another interception. This guy just can't find his own players. And he's brought down, and this defense gets the ball back. This is why the passion of college football runs so deep. The rivalries, and when you lose, man, does it stick with you. No doubt about it, Reese. This was a game circled for a very, very...